Hello and welcome to Pro Academy classes. I am very excited to share with you the very first project course which I have created for my audience. And this course is absolutely free. And I have created this course in a simple step by step way so that you can understand what we are actually doing and why we are doing it. In this course, we are going to create a very simple real time chat application like the one you are seeing on the screen. And we are going to use Mernstack along with WebSocket to build this chat application. So let me quickly show you what we are going to build in this course. If a user does not have an account, the user can create his account by signing up to the application. Or if the user already have an account, he can click on this login link and the user will be redirected to login page. And from here also, we can go to sign up page. So let me go ahead and let me quickly create a user. And when the user clicks on this sign up button, an account will be created for the user. So here you can see the message user created successfully. Now the user can go to login page. There he can enter his email and password. And when he clicks on this login button, the user will be redirected to home page. So this home page is basically the chat area where the user can chat. Currently, you won't see anything here because this user, we have created it newly. So he does not have any existing chats. But what user can do is he can search for a user by typing his or her name in this search box. So for example, let's say I want to start a chat with Mary. As you can see, Mary is already online. So you can see this green border around her. And when I click on the start chat button, it should start a new chat with Mary. Okay. Let me go ahead and let me send a message. Let's say hi. And this message should be sent in real time. We should also be able to send emojis. So from here, we can select emojis and we can send it in the chat. And we should also be able to send images in the chat. As you can see. Then we can also upload a profile picture for the user. For that, we have to click on this avatar. It will take us to the profile page. From here, we can choose an image. Let me select this one. And let's click on this upload button. So you see profile picture has been uploaded. And now if we go to home page. Here you can see the profile pic of the user. So as you see, all the messages will be sent and received in real time with the help of WebSocket. And this is a really simple real time chat application. And this project will help you understand how to use the concept of Node.js and Express for backend and React for frontend to create a full stack application with real time data transfer between two or more clients. If this course gets a good response from my audience and if the feedback is positive, I will create a fully fledged chat application like WhatsApp or Messenger with video call and audio call features and location and file shares, etc. But that will be in the future with many other project courses coming on the way for free only on Procademy classes. Now you might be wondering why you should spend your precious time on this course when there are a lot of other courses on this topic already available on different platforms. Let me highlight some of the points to convince you to take this course. First of all, this course is absolutely free and it is available on YouTube for all. You do not have to pay a single penny unless you want to contribute something for this channel. You will gain practical experience on how to use Node.js and Express with React by building a real world application. Students will learn how to implement real time features using WebSocket. This course will equip students with skills highly sought after in the tech industry. This course will cover important aspects of Merns tech, including MongoDB, ExpressJS, React and Node.js. Students will learn by doing, making the learning process more engaging and effective. Building a chat app will help students develop strong problem solving and debugging skills. This course will emphasize best practices and industry standards for building scalable and maintainable applications. 
I will also emphasize to break down complex concepts into easy to understand terms. And finally, the course can help students improve their job prospect and career advancement. This real-time chat app project can be valuable asset for students for their final year project submission. So I hope I am able to convince you to take this course and I hope this course will be very helpful for you in your future endeavors. Next, let me explain who should be the real audience for taking this course. This course is for the audience who have basic knowledge of Node.js and Express for creating APIs. Students should also have a basic knowledge of React and Redux for UI design as well as state management. And we are going to use React in this course for UI development and we will use Redux for state management. Then a basic knowledge of MongoDB and Mongoose is also required. In this course, we will be using MongoDB for storing data and we will use Mongoose for CRUD operation in MongoDB database from our Express application. And also a basic knowledge of HTML and CSS is required because I'm not going to explain the HTML and CSS which I'll be using in this course. Of course, I'll be sharing the HTML and CSS which I will use in this course with each video. But if you want to modify the look and feel of this application according to your need, you should be having HTML and CSS knowledge. So many of you guys were asking me to create a Mernstack project and that's why I have created this course and I hope this course will be very helpful for you and you will like this course. Designing and creating this course has taken around four months for me. So I really hope that you find this course helpful. If you don't have a basic knowledge of Node.js and Express or React or MongoDB, I already have courses on these topics available on my channel absolutely free. So if you want, you can learn the concepts of these tags from those courses and then you can come back to this course to understand how we can use them together to build a fully fledged application from both backend and frontend. So this was a high level overview of what you can expect from this course and what technologies we are going to use in this course. If you like this course or any of my previous free courses, please subscribe to this channel and share this channel with your friends and family. I'm putting a lot of effort in creating these courses but the views on my channel is going down day by day. So I would request you to hit the like button if you really like the video, subscribe to this channel and also please share this channel with your friends. This is all from this lecture. In the next lecture, we are going to set up the development environment to start developing this real-time chat application.